Okay, so. <laughs> you can see I had our little shed door open here and was cleaning up a little bit here. We had a little fire last night, like we do a lot of times. We take all the branches and sticks and throw them in the old steel wheelbarrow here and we hang out on the patio, have a snack or whatever and, you know, burn them up, have a fire. Well, I had the old broom here, was cleaning up a little bit. I had just dropped Jack off at his mother's. It's kind of Sunday evening. And as I was going to put this broom back, this little guy paid me a visit and I almost stepped right on him in bare feet. <laughs> Scared the living daylights out of me. Um, we have not seen a lot of snakes around here where we live. But, lately we have been seeing some of these guys. And mainly, we don't see them very long. And they kind of scurry away um, over here in this area when we're cutting grass or whatever. But this guy has obviously made a little bit of a home in a cool spot under the doors of our shed. And, you know, regardless of if you're, if you like snakes or if you're used to snakes or whatever, when you almost step on one in a bare feet, in a bare foot, uh, it's a little shocking. So this guy's kind of just chilling. He's just kind of hanging out. He's just kind of staring at me. We've never really been too much into snakes. We do think they're absolutely beautiful creatures. Had some roommates in college that had snakes as pets. We never really got into it. This looks kind of like a typical snake that we see around here and around the metro parks. Um, a lot of people refer to them as garden snakes or garter snakes or something of that nature. Yellow and brown, got a couple of stripes on the back. But I'm not absolutely sure, to be honest with you. Now, there is a guy who knows his snakes. He's a fellow YouTuber. And we connected some time ago. Oh, there's his tongue sticking his tongue out a little bit. His name is Todd Audrey. Oh, look at that. So his tongue is kind of pink or red, and then he has like a black tip to the tongue. That's pretty neat. But anyway, his name is Todd Audrey. He would know, so he will probably watch this video. And Todd, you can tell us what this little guy is. I think I've seen ones like this on Todd's channel, actually. I should have paid a little more attention. It's hard to remember them all. But, uh, yeah, what a neat guy. So, it looks like he's kind of down below the door here. I'm going to open the door a little bit and just kind of see if he kind of comes out of there. Now, of course, seeing a little guy like this always makes us wonder then, is there some sort of a, a nest around <laughs> or in our shed? Or whatever. Which, again, if they're not poisonous or anything, who cares? My fear would be that Lacey, of course, she's over there wondering what I got going on. Aren't you? She's like, I will eat it. Let me out. <laughs> so, of course, we don't want that to happen. Um, so, I'm going to see if this guy will kind of brush off here in this ivy. See if I can kind of coax it to kind of come out a little bit. Come on. Let's, let's go the other way here. Let's go away from Lacey so you don't get eaten. It looks like he's going to draw back under the shed, which is what I don't want. You can see him over here. He's relatively long. I'm going to poke him through this way. Hey. That. Oh, dude. Did that thing just hiss? I think that thing just hissed, man. And I also think it just went right into my shed. Yeah, it sounded to me like it hissed. That's weird. I don't like that. Also, seems like it went right in the shed. So I don't like that. I don't like that idea. So if it's shot in the shed, that stinks. So I guess I'm going to try to open this other door here. Got to unlatch it. Yeah, it sounded like it made a noise, dude. Now, it could have just been the leaves rustling when it moved so quickly. 
but well, let me unlatch this thing here and oh boy I know a lot of people are probably laughing right now because they're like oh it's just a little garter snake but guess what when you're not sure and you know it's kind of wicked It actually wasn't that small. It was not humongous. But yeah, so I think it went in the shed. So that stinks. And now we don't know where it is. This is the fish tank stand that we are work gonna be working on on the one 15 that we got so I'm guessing he's hiding somewhere here probably behind the plow great so I think what I'm gonna do is just leave the door open and kind of walk away <laughs> and maybe he'll just come out I do have this little stick grabber thing which is kind of like a kind of like a snake grabber thing so I'm gonna take this with me and we'll see if this guy comes out it's pretty fast little bugger but anyway Todd you probably know what this dude is because he he finds snakes and wild snakes all the time does videos on them we'll put a link in the description of Todd's channel and I'm pretty sure I have found him I have seen a video of him holding a snake just like this. So, you know, I'm not too concerned, but I certainly don't want it popping out of my shed when I'm in there, or Jack, scaring the daylights out of us either. So we will see what happens, and I'll do another update here. Not a big fan of a wild snake. Not a big fan. <laughs> okay, I had to let Lace out, so she's out here. Let's see what's going on. Find a snake? I mean, I don't know what's going on with this dude. Let's see if he's still in here, maybe if he left. Oh, there he is. It's peeking to say apparently he went that way when he went in there. Come on, why don't you come out? <laughs> I don't know what's going on with this dude. It's kind of. He's pretty big. He ain't tiny. So he's back there tied up around the the brooms and the rakes. Now I got Lacey behind me. Well, he's probably just going to keep pulling in further. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to back off. Just let him go. He's a pretty neat little dude. Got those... It looks like two brown stripes on the back. Yeah, he's little. All right, Lace. She don't even know he's there. She's like, I'm just going to eat this grass. We're going to go in and li leave this guy alone, and he'll probably leave. Okay? She's like, again, I, d I don't care. I'm just going to eat this grass. I don't care what you're saying. They're just words to me. Well, anyway, check him out, Todd. Let us know what's up. And you guys check out Todd Audrey, Autry, a uh, really, really cool guy. Does lots of videos on snakes that he finds and goes out in groups and all kind of awesome stuff. So check that out. And I'll put links in the description. We'll see you later. Lacey's just going to eat her grass, right? Say bye, Lace. She doesn't care. She's going to eat her grass. Well, the one good part, I guess, is if we have these guys around. I haven't seen any chipmunks lately. So maybe uh, they better take care of some of the chipmunk problem we had. So that's good. <laughs> See you next time.